Nam the Kano was our target, but we missed him. Kenya police officer confessed, revealed how he was extradicted and why. Now I understand what the Kenya president meant by that statement of his when he said that if I dare open my mouth and say what led to the extradition of Namdekano, Nigeria will have no choice than to divide. Hmm. Can you imagine? I'm not surprised because it was also revealed that it wasn't their intention to extradite Namdekano. Their, in, their, their main plan was to get him executed secretly. So they will now say that Namdekano died in Kenya while coming to um, do one or two things and all of that. You understand? So um, now this very um, detained Kenya police officer is now giving us the truth and the fact that the IPOP leader Namdekano was actually um, uh, was was extradited because they missed the original plan of getting him executed. Now, what is now telling us right now is what uh, everyone is still wondering why it took so long for this truth to be revealed. Thank God for yesterday's um, hearing because yesterday hearing went a long way in helping us to cop out a lot of facts and truths concerning uh, the IPOP leaders um, hearing. <laughs> Try out to say. All right, uh, let's let, let's listen and know what he actually meant on this very statement of his okay this is morning news yesterday's trial commenced as the presence of mr president momo Ari and some other personalities was taken note of the hearing which commenced in the morning yesterday has yielded a positive result in favor of Mr. of Namdekano. Fresh evidence emanates as detained Kenya police officer has spoken and given reasons why the IPOP leader was extradicted and why. According to him, the original plan was to get him executed secretly, not to get him extradited. We lose our target. But we have no choice, so we had to hand him over back to the country. Namdekano, who is already in detention, has pleaded not guilty of all count charges, yet the federal government is still getting him hold in detention. During yesterday's hearing, one count charge was actually taken off from all that has been alleged on him as Justice Binta Nyako assures him of fairness in the next hearing. Whether he's fair or he's not fair, nobody is asking him, asking her of that. Uh, one thing that is very sure in this is that people are watching. Yes. So even if it tried to be unfair, somehow, somehow the truth will still be revealed. Hmm? Yes, the truth is to be revealed. So, my dear people, I know it will sound like a shocker to you, but that is just the truth. You've heard it from the horse's mouth. It was not just told. It was not just told. It's one of the reasons for the uh, for yesterday here, in fact, this very um, evidence that just surfaced is one of the reasons. But something is really paining me in this very in, in this Kenya people's issue 
if they since they know that um something of this sort will later happen that we start dragging their name to the mud why did they have to give a helping hand to the federal government of nigeria why see how they have rubbish the country and i want to tell you that kenyatta administration is now going to be tagged the worst in the history of kenya because of the dirty names it has given to them you understand and that's just it so i'm not surprised anyway it's one of those things it's one of those things so uh, my people let's hear you and let's know what your take and what your opinion on this that has just been reviewed maybe don't forget to leave them below the comment section click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos thank you